Mark over there. <laughs> All right, take it. Right, so Hercules hold. When you're doing the Hercules hold, you're going to have your back or your shoulders against a pillar. And what we're aiming to do is keep your arms uh, slightly bent at a 45 degree angle. All right, so you use obviously the pillar. Your arms will be slightly bent. Don't lock them out because you're going to fatigue your triceps. Slightly bent, 45 degrees, and then focus on your rhythm of breathing. Don't contract. Your arms will come a set of hooks. You're holding on and focus on that breathing rhythm. All right, don't hold your breath. Okay. Yeah? Got it. All right, just slightly bend the elbows, 45 degrees right. against the post. Yeah? I'll give it a go right now, yeah. Let's do it. All right. You have 20, so I need a so, timer. So come, like, your feet will be slightly forward. Yeah. Don't, you're, so you will, you will never, you won't be able to, you might be able to, but it depends on the rules. You might be able to lean with your uh, waist, or it might be just your shoulders. Best thing to do is practice it without, 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 your, without your glutes back. They mean here? Yeah, so it's going to engage more your core. It's going to work you harder. Okay. Yeah? Got it. All right. Half out here? Yeah, and then just out of this position, right? Hold on, hold on. I'll take the weight. Right? Sharif, you tell me when, yeah? Right. 
Breathe, breathe, breathe. Relax everything, relax, don't squeeze. Everything's relaxed. Keep breathing, breathing, breathing. I want to see you breathing more. Good. Yeah, I got it. Alright? Yeah. Okay, not bad. Yeah? Yeah. Okay? I think you said it comps 30 kilos, a little bit less. A little bit less than that. Yeah, it's 24. So you think, think comps are 30? I think the hand position will be a bit different. Oh, yeah. Like this instead of. Yeah. Yeah. Probably, this is probably harder. Yeah. You always want your stronger hand on top. I mean, I feel like you shouldn't I be using a dumbbell. Alright, sledgehammer. He told me to use a kettlebell. Though. Yeah, that's fine. Look, you're going to engage the same muscle groups. Oh, okay. But a sledgehammer. That'd be perfect. Sledgehammer's perfect. Yeah. I don't know if there's any other. Okay. Yeah, how long is it do guys typically hold it up there for? At a least minute? a minute. At least a minute. Yeah, yeah, you wanna you wanna push the minute mark. Yeah. Yeah. He just had to be twenty seconds for now. Yeah, yeah that's probably could have went longer for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Yeah. But. You doing a few sets? Yeah, two more. Yeah. I just slowly build that endurance. That's all it is. Yeah, endurance. something I've never done. I'm gonna have to hold it. Very easy, very easy. Mark was saying at least a minute, I don't think that would be a problem. Especially after I have 10 more weeks of training. I think it'll be a good event for me, for sure. <laughs> it's too heavy for me. All right, guys, successful training session today. Uh, hit a PR on the dual barbell bench, 245 pounds each arm. My best before this was 225 about four or five months ago. That was just for fun, as well as today, just for fun. Though this was sort of in preparation for what I have going on in three days from now in Bahrain, doing uh, loadable barbell, loadable dumbbells, excuse me. It's up to, loadable up to 140 kilograms. So what I'm gonna do is attempt 235 pounds each arm, full range of motion to chest, elbows locked out on the incline bench. Uh, sitting ups I can do. This will be the heaviest dumbbell press I've ever done. And I think I have ever seen anyone done in history. I don't think anyone's ever done 235 each arm. There are definitely guys capable of it, but I don't see, I don't see any footage of it. So, no video, it didn't happen, right? Um, so that's really fun, coming up in a few days. Uh, a new exercise I've been doing that just started today in preparation for the Hercules hold at Wembley in July is 
exactly that. A Hercules hold can be done with a sledgehammer, a kettlebell, dumbbell. Sebastian, my coach at the moment, told me to do it with a kettlebell, 20 second holds. Um, Mark and I went over some cues if you guys want to practice it yourself and see what that feels like. It's fun, it's not too difficult. I don't feel any aches or pain after doing it. Um, he was also telling me though, the guys in that competition are capable of doing at least a minute. So I definitely have some work to do to catch up. I'm sure I could have done maybe 40, 45 seconds, but a minute might be pushing it, who knows? But that just means you guys have to keep watching to find out. And on that note, I'm signing off. See you guys soon.